morning guys um today we're actually in firth me and brennan are going on a breakfast date and we wanted to explore firth since we've never really explored it um what else are we doing today the kids are in school so it's just us we're gonna check out this we think it's a german costco but we'll find out and see if it is but yeah first thing first Brennan got a pee. That's a normal human thing to do. <laughs> Always. Now we're looking for a public restroom because the cafe is not open yet. But you can see that's their um, town hall, the Ruth House. We'll see. At least it stopped raining. Oh, we're crossing. He really needs to go. Came from there. See that little statue of Ludwig? And then the cafe is right here. Cafe Lewis. Let's go, babe. Oh, they shut it down. What? No. They were like, it's cold. So cute. Oh, it has such a cool vibe. This is, oh look, it's like tailor thing. Like the tailors it has buttons and stuff. And they have cute seatings. And so they didn't have breakfast. Just coffee and cakes. <laughs> weekends. On weekends. <laughs> what is that one? Here's my thumb. That looks good though. Yeah, you guys, look at this pretty street. It's so cute. You come here. You see the little cute Irish cottage pub sign. It's so cool. Finally have him. When the army calls, even on his day off. <laughs> Just important man. But look at this. You see that house over there? It's like one of the medieval homes. The black and gray. Well, what? I looked it up. I did my on. little research. Oh, you did research this time. Look how cute. Just the details. We can walk back there and take a picture later. <gasps> Look at that one. I know, I'm on a hunt on that one street. It's like a pretty street. We can walk over here. See, they're walking here. No, but you moved over. I oh. moved back to the sidewalk. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Ooh, it's gold. All right. That one says Wog Strawberry. Oh, look at this, boo. That's it. I'm gonna get hit. Okay. Oh, that's not it. Okay. No, Where do we go? Oh. There's so many half timber. Oh, it's straight. You see? Like over there, the yellow, the half timbered structures. Even over here, wow. Do you see that street over there? It's this one, but I think it's under construction. Yeah. People actually live here. Here we go. Let's see, it's called Selgros. And Brennan said they usually have 
bulk stuff here. Ooh. Oh. Did we find Costco in Germany? No. <laughs> okay, guys. Hold up. How do I turn? Let me turn. One, two, three. There we go. Here's what happened. We came here. Brendan asked for a membership. So we just found out that you can only come here if you're a business owner. Business owner gets access to this. And it is like Costco because they have everything. I mean everything. They have clothes, food, everything. So Brandon got a one day pass and we're going to take advantage of it. And then it's like aisles. But Brandon said they have this in Romania. And apparently he was able to access it there. You guys look. It's not just food, like they have bikes, clothes, big old ketchups, they got toys, so Brennan's like, are you sure you have to be a business owner? The lady was like, yes. You got the nuggets for the kids. You guys, we also saw this. They got chicken wings. They have, what is that? Peppers red and hot. And chili cheese nuggets. And it says finger food right there. They even have a Halloween section. Look at that. Spread <laughs> his sausage. Get your meat. Dry age beefed. Look at this big old tomahawk. <laughs> and then you get like the alcohol section over there. See this tin cans of cookies? Already got all their Christmas stuff. And they have a uh, Bistro, you can see that right there, and this are the wine selection. It's this place is pretty huge. Oh, there's another area for fish, babe. Like maybe it's fresh fish. Oh my gosh, look at that! Wow. Zing! That's crazy! Okay, guys, we spent 200, well, 181, almost 200 euros. I just rounded up, but. No, it says 181. But we got all our essentials. Let me see, show you guys the front. If you can see the sign. It's right there and then it's next to I guess it says fresh parades I don't know but I even got a big old jasmine rice because we eat a lot of rice successful baby for now, for now. <laughs> oh, thankfully they grant us access so that was nice you guys so I was looking at like what you need to get a membership at Selgr Selgros, 
Cell gross? I don't know how to say it. Cell gross. So it does say you can apply for a customer card at the store. You can't like do it online. And then it tells you our offer is open to resellers, self-employed, freelancers, commercial customers, restaurant owners, dealers, craftsmen, and all other tradespeople. So basically business people, right? And then that's when they get a photo ID of you, which they did for Brandon to give him the day pass. And then the business license, certificate from the tax office, commercial register, liquor license. So I don't know, I guess if you're a bartender, does that mean you get one or you get access to it? And then we were talking about like, they have this thing called HBB here, like on post or whatever so it's like home based business right HBB so then that's another thing that I'm thinking like if you're an HBB owner do you get an access to sell, sell gross or whatever um, but I don't know I thought that was just a question that was a good question because then if you're like HBB owner I mean that would be kind of cool right you get an access there it's like Costco. Just something to think about. Yep. You guys, I have like our receipt and they give you a receipt that's like full paper. But anyway, so yeah, we went to Sell Girls, Cash and Carry, members only, business owners only. And um, it was pretty cool. I think the lady was really nice that she gave us a day access. And getting information about it we really just miss um the whole purpose of this video was like we really miss costco back in the states you know we usually shop in bulk especially us as a family of four um but yeah that's pretty cool that was really nice but that's all i've got for today um i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and seeing our life here in germany i hope that you guys subscribe like give us a thumbs up it really helps us, um, you know, expand our Wachimahal channel. And yeah, and also by the end of this year, we actually have a um, big news coming up. Um, pretty much our contract here in Germany is ending. And by next year, we should be moving. And we will make a big announcement about that. So just stay tuned. Thanks, guys. I've been thinking about myself, yeah. thinking how I 